In this video, we have been given that x plus 1 divided by x equals to the square root of 2. And we shall have to find x to the power of 13 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 13. Now to solve this, first of all, let's call this equation 1. And from equation 1, if we square both sides, we shall have x plus 1 divided by x raised to the power of 2 equaling to the square root of 2 raised to the power of 2. Now this 2 will cancel with the square root. And so we shall have x plus 1 divided by x raised to the power of 2 equaling to 2. And this can also be written as x plus 1 divided by x and then times x plus 1 divided by x and this is equal to 2. And if we expand this, we shall have x times x which is x to the power of 2 and then plus x times 1 divided by x plus 1 divided by x times x and then plus 1 divided by x times 1 divided by x equaling to 2. Now this will cancel with that and also this will cancel with that. And so we shall have x to the power of 2 plus 1 and then plus 1 plus 1 times 1 which is 1 divided by x times x which is x to the power of 2 equaling to 2. And this will become x to the power of 2 plus 1 plus 1 which is 2 and then plus 1 divided by x to the power of 2 equaling to 2. And at this point we can take 2 to the right hand side. So we shall have x to the power of 2 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 2 equaling to 2 minus 2. And so x to the power of 2 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 2 will be equal to 0. And at this point, in order to have the same denominator, let's multiply this by x to the power of 2 and then divide through by x to the power of 2. So this will give us x to the power of 2 times x to the power of 2, which is x to the power of 4, divided by x to the power of 2, plus 1 divided by x to the power of 2, equaling to 0. And since we have the same denominator, we can combine the numerators. So we shall have x to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 2 equaling to 0. And if we cross multiply, we shall have x to the power of 4 plus 1 equaling to x to the power of 2 times 0, which is 0. And so x to the power of 4 will be equal to negative 1. And we shall call this equation 2. Now if you remember, we were told to find x to the power of 13 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 13. x to the power of 13 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 13 can also be written as x to the power of 12 times x and then plus 1 divided by x to the power of 12 times x. And we also know that 12 is the same as 4 times 3. So this can also be written as x to the power of 4 raised to the power of 3 times x and then plus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 raised to the power of 3 times x. And from equation 2, we know that x to the power of 4 equals to negative 1. Therefore, x to the power of 13 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 13 will be equal to negative 1 to the power of 3 times x and then plus 1 divided by negative 1 to the power of 3 times x. And this will be equal to, we know that negative 1 to the power of 3 is negative 1 times x and then plus 1 divided by negative 1 times x. And so this will be equal to negative x minus 1 divided by x. And if we take out negative 1, we shall have minus into x plus 1 divided by x. And if you remember, we were told that x plus 1 over x equals to square root of 2. So, x to the power of 13 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 13 will be equal to negative square root of 2. And that's our answer. Therefore, that's how you can solve such a question. If you have found this video helpful, don't forget to like it and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.